Albania is a country located in the Balkans region of Europe. It is bordered by Greece to the south, North Macedonia to the east, Kosovo to the northeast, and Montenegro to the northwest. The Adriatic and Ionian seas are to the west of Albania. The country has a total area of 28,748 square kilometers and a population of approximately 2.9 million people. Albania has a rich history dating back to ancient times. The Illyrians, an ancient tribe, were the first known inhabitants of the region. The country was later conquered by the Romans, Byzantines, and Ottomans. In the early 20th century, Albania declared independence from the Ottoman Empire and became a republic in 1912. The country was occupied by fascist Italy during World War II and later became a communist state under the rule of Enver Hoxha. In 1991, Albania transitioned to a multi-party democracy. Albanian culture is a unique blend of ancient and modern elements. The country has a rich tradition of folk music and dance, as well as a vibrant visual arts scene. Albania is also known for its traditional clothing, which varies depending on the region. The country is predominantly Muslim, but there is also a significant Orthodox Christian and Catholic population. Albanian cuisine is a mix of Mediterranean, Balkan, and Turkish influences. Some popular dishes include bayrak, a pastry filled with meat, cheese, or vegetables, and tev kosi, a casserole made with yogurt and lamb. Seafood is also a staple in coastal regions, with dishes such as grilled fish and octopus. Traditional drinks include rakia, a strong brandy, and boza, a fermented grain drink. In conclusion, Albania is a small country located in the Balkans region of Europe. It has a rich history, culture, and cuisine that have been shaped by its geographic location and the various cultures that have passed through the region over the centuries. Despite the challenges it has faced, the country is now a multi-party democracy and is actively working to develop its economy and infrastructure. The flag of Albania features a red background with a black, double-headed eagle in the center. The eagle is a symbol of the country's independence and freedom. The colors of the flag have their own significance, with red symbolizing bravery and black representing the country's dark past. The flag of Albania has a rich history that is closely tied to the country's struggles for independence and freedom. The first flag of Albania was a red flag with a black double-headed eagle in the center. This flag was used during the Albanian Revolt of 1912, which led to the country's independence from the Ottoman Empire. The eagle on the flag is a symbol of the Albanian people's desire for freedom and independence, and the red and black colors were chosen to represent the bloodshed and sacrifice of those who fought for the country's independence. During the country's occupation by fascist Italy in World War II, the flag was banned and replaced with the Italian tricolor. After the war, when Albania became a communist state, the flag was replaced again with a red flag with a gold star in the center. In 1992, after the fall of communism in Albania, the country adopted its current flag, which features a red background with a black, double-headed eagle in the center. The eagle is a symbol of the country's independence and freedom, and the red and black colors are still seen as symbolizing the bloodshed and sacrifice of those who fought for the country's independence. Today, the flag of Albania is a symbol of the country's national identity and is prominently displayed on public buildings and during national holidays and celebrations. It is an important symbol of the country's history and the sacrifices made to achieve its independence and freedom. Visiting Albania is relatively easy, as the country is well connected to the rest of Europe by air, road, and rail. The main airport in the country is Tirana International Airport, which is located just outside of the capital city of Tirana. From there, visitors can take buses or taxis to other parts of the country. There are also several bus and train companies that operate within the country, making it easy to travel between cities. If you prefer to drive, you can rent a car or take a guided tour. When it comes to accommodations, Albania has a range of options to suit different budgets. 
visitors can choose from luxury hotels, mid-range resorts, and budget-friendly hostels. There are also many vacation rentals available, such as apartments and villas. The people of Albania are known for their hospitality and warmth towards visitors. They are generally very friendly and eager to help tourists discover their country. Albanians are also very proud of their culture and heritage, and they enjoy sharing it with others. The culture of Albania is diverse, with many different groups of people living in the country. The majority of the population is Albanian, but there are also significant numbers of Greek, Macedonian, and Montenegrin minorities. Albanians are predominantly Muslim, but there are also Orthodox Christians and Catholics. The official language of Albania is Albanian, which is a unique language with its own alphabet. English is also widely spoken, so visitors should have no trouble communicating with locals. In general, Albania is a safe country to visit, but as with any destination, it's important to take the usual precautions. Visitors should be aware of pickpocketing and other petty crimes, and they should be careful when using ATMs and credit cards. Overall, Albania is a beautiful country with a rich culture and friendly people. It offers visitors a chance to experience a unique blend of ancient and modern culture, and to enjoy the country's natural beauty, delicious cuisine, and warm hospitality.